Oh, I didn't know I was counting my deaths. Uh, it looks like we may be having a problem with the stream. So I'll just wait for feedback on that before I carry on. Otherwise, it's been pretty much exactly the same amount of time as yesterday. Yeah, it's working. <laughs> you missed me actually doing it, which sucks. Right, that's the tie-dye. Which one next? We've got the juggler, the B140, the waffler, the trench, the 2600, and the coded. Or the return to hub, which we're not going to do. Hmm. Juggler. Uh, what? Oh, slime. Are those slime blocks? Yeah, they are. Okay. Oh, I landed right on the edge. That was a good one. That's the juggler. Hello, 17 Perry. How is your day? I'm playing Diversity 2. I'm currently doing the dropper branch and I'm trying to choose between the coded, the 2600, the trench, the waffler, and the B140. Which one sounds most interesting to you? Trench from pepperoni. Perry, do you have a do you have any um what's the word? Do you have any preference? That's it. Figured it out. You still here? Yes, you are. 2600. We'll go with yours for now because you're new. 2600. Or well, that one. Oh my god, no what? I don't like this choice. <laughs> This is going to be an absolute nightmare. Oh, that was close. Oh, okay. I think I get, I think I kind of get what I need to do here. Don't die, don't die. I died. That did not need to be... That did not need to end like that. I landed on the edge. <laughs> That's such a pain. If those two blocks were on the same level, that would have been no problem whatsoever. Don't want to take any risks okay how do i get down <gasps> if i had died can you see the command block can't see the command block there we go uh that one where i kind of fell and landed on the slime block and died if you hold shift when you land on a slime block you'll still take full damage if you were high enough to take full damage so that is why i took full damage there let's go to the trench I think I might do one more branch after this, maybe. Depending on, possibly. <laughs> but 
but I might not. So we'll see how I feel, depending on how, how much longer this takes me. That one, that one wasn't too bad. How many more do we have? Presume I don't want to fall off there. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay, how many more? One, two, three more. So we've got the Waffler, the B140, and the Coded. It was quite simple, yeah. I guess after the... Um, other ones it was just an easy one b140 coded or waffler man when i was playing diversity one i really should have played it like this it's so much so much better to play it on stream with other people to talk to or even without other people to talk to because i don't really have to talk to myself because someone will show up won't they <laughs> usually Okay, these are definitely waffles. Oh right, I need to land in the middle there, don't I? I see. This is the new sponge texture, isn't it? Dang it. I moved too early. And I moved too late. There we go. Nice. Welcome to the Waffle House. Thank you. You are a waffle. There are lots of waffles here. Okay. Coded or B140. This branch, this, this dropper branch is so much easier than the dropper branch on the first diversity. It's ridiculous. Well, yeah, it just feels like they're less cluttered. Coded. Nope, it's the other one. I would imagine because I know Jesper the End is part of the build team on this map, and he has maps a map series known as the Code, 1, 2, and 3. So this may be based on those, based on the fact that it's called the Coded, but I don't know. Yeah, this looks to be the same kind of... Did it just go 1, 3? So it's a bunch of numbers. 8, 1, 3, 6, 7. <laughs> I'm going to have to remember that. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two, nine. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two, nine, four. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two, nine, four. I'll get through that four. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two, nine, four. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two, nine, four. God damn it. Eight, one, three, six, seven, two, nine, four. Water. Da 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 da. Eight one three six seven two nine four. Whoops. There we go. Which leaves? Yeah. See the entire principle behind the code. If you haven't played them. Uh, was you got a piece of paper and there was a puzzle which would give you a five digit code and then you rename the piece of paper to that five digit code, stick it in the dispenser and it gives it opens up the next puzzle. So that was 
basically okay the b140 okay last one yep this is the last one after this I don't know what which branch we're gonna do if any where am I going can I cheat can't tell where I'm aiming for this is gonna kill me this is quite an impressive landscape whoa indeed what am I aiming for here? do you think I need to fall down them like this? could be the case I want to see what's down off the end of that one. Can I make that jump? Parkour King? He can! Oh, live up to his name. Parkour King still being a boss. Can't see. Well, if you can't see, then you can only continue falling. <sighs> no! No! I've only died 52 times in this branch. It's time to boss it again. Parkour King! Okay, this is a strange concept for a dropper. Right, making good progress here. No, yes. Is there anything off the end of this one that I might be looking out for? No, I don't see anything I could possibly land in here. I, it does look like I need to just climb down. I feel like I was leaning in very close to the camera there. Well, we're almost there now. We should be good, unless I walk off the edge like an idiot, which is not unlike me. Let's head over there. And then down here. Here. Maybe not here. Oh, too late now. Here. Almost there. Right. Ooh. Okay. This should be a safe dropping distance. There we go. Wonder if that was intended or not. I'm going to have to look it up. 
Well, there we go. That is whoa. Another one. Um. Hmm. I need to fall onto the button. <sighs> okay. This is going to be, this is not going to be fun. I wonder if this is even how it's supposed to work. believe after giving us eight droppers he's now expecting us to do another one shall I try climbing down I feel like this isn't gonna really work because um, like it widens out into the nether area. Like it widens out into the nether area a bit further down. Like I don't really think there's anything I can really land on. I feel like... Oh. I really feel like there's got to be an easy way of doing this. Mr. Button! Ah! Uh, excuse me. I hit it! Come on! I did click it, didn't I? Okay. This is irritating. If only it was a pressure plate. Okay, let's try and parkour down it. I feel like that has to be an acceptable method. While you're falling, you've got other options. Ah! Okay, this might work. Potentially. There was a hole there. No! There was another hole there. I'm sweating all over my computer. That's lovely, isn't it? I'm sure you really wanted to know that. Okay, let's try just a straight drop again. One more. Oh, okay. Is there something on here that I can use? Yeah, okay. That I definitely just hit the button there because the wall disappeared. So you can't just drop straight down onto it. It's interesting because I thought the whole point of droppers was you were supposed to just drop all the way down. But apparently now you're allowed to use the 
level to your advantage. And in fact, need to use the level to your advantage. I was not excited, I was actually very worried because I thought because the block disappeared and I didn't have it in my inventory when I respawned that I might actually have just disappeared and I might have broken the map. <laughs> but fortunately that wasn't the case. Ooh, okay. We're into the danger zone. Respawn, I mean re-heal up. Drop down to here. I can see the button. It's so close and yet so far. Just go to creative, please. <laughs> I've only cheated once in this map, and I, and I wouldn't even call it cheating, it was to fix the broken map. I, I, I think I actually screwed myself over, because the number of zombies I spawned in that arena was probably a bit too large. Uh. <gasps> what I might do have maybe say five more attempts and then come back to it tomorrow because it's half past midnight here a bit tired and I do need to get up in the morning so that might it might just have to wait but then again you never know I might get it I don't want to go to creative going to creative is cheating yeah why did I do that why Maybe I should jump in the lava. Hmm. Maybe not one block deep lava though. It's so close. Oh. Can I get those portal guns back? Dang. <laughs> I moved to the side. Why did I move to the side? Can you see where my crosshair is there? Can you see that? You can. Look how close it is to that button. Jump into the lava next to nether rack. Then once you're in the lava, swim to the closest block. Sounds dangerous. Want to hear a joke? Sure, hit me up with a joke. I'm really in the mood for a joke right now, Zarko Croft. As long as the joke is not my face, then I'm happy.
Who's there? Waiting for a knock-knock joke from Zarkocraft, in case you're wondering why the silence. No. <laughs> Ebola. Ebola who? Uh, no, I'm dead. Uh, where do I go from here? <laughs> Ebola is after me. Oh dear. From here? Yes! That was an epic jump. Okay, I'm happy now. I'm just glad I made that. Heading for that quartz now, or maybe over there. That's a hilarious joke. No! I hate my life. Ebola, please come and kill me. Actually, no, don't do that. Welcome back, Pepperoni. I got it again. I got the button. Oh. Well, you missed, you missed the hilarious joke from Zalka Craft. this game. Okay, I'm going to have two more attempts at doing this properly, and then I'm going to head off. And here I thought I'd have time to do another branch. Who knew that actually getting the wool would take so bloody long? By the way, uh, I'm doing that marathon on Saturday. Let me know if there are any good custom maps that you want me to play. Because I'm probably going to have a lot of time where I don't really know what I'm doing. Because I'm not very well prepared for this. So, that would be rather helpful to me to give me some sort of direction on Saturday while I'm not playing this or Skyrim. Hold on, I'm just going to go do a quick dance of victory around my room, back in a moment. Ah. I'm glad. Look at this, the blue wool. I finally made it. Get that blue wool out the sky and onto this pedestal right now. Before it changes its mind and goes back to its chest. Excellent. Look at all this progress we made today. Look at the walls turn blue to celebrate my victory. So this is our monument so far. We have the parkour, no, the dropper wool, the puzzle wool, the introduction wool, the park that's not parkour, that is arena and the other one. 
parkour. We actually got three walls today, parkour, puzzle, and arena. I did the second half of the puzzle, then I spent ages dying in the arena, then I spent ages dying in the dropper. And I thought I spent ages dying in parkour yesterday, but apparently not. I unfortunately... Okay, I'll wait, I'll wait around for a few minutes while Pepperoni looks for his custom map name. Oh, I'm almost halfway through now, I think. Yep, six more walls to go. I found five. Found. I've earned five. Six more to go. We've got survival, boss battle, uh, labyrinth, escape, trivia, and adventure still to go. So I want to save because those are mostly branches that I don't find myself enjoying too. That I don't think I'm going to find myself enjoying too much. Because survival I don't really like. Adventure will probably be okay. Uh, boss battle should be alright. Trivia I'm really looking forward to because I like trivia. And escape. The escape section in the first map I really did not like. But I wasn't streaming it. I was just sitting there raging at myself. So I might be able to get tips from the audience, if there is any audience around when it comes to me doing the escape bit. Uh, but I don't know, it's not going to be the same, obviously. So maybe maybe I'll end up loving it and it might be my favourite branch of the map, but I don't know. So, that was a good, a good run tonight. I did like almost three hours. Found it, excellent. I will start. I'm going to start a list. Um, Thiefcraft. Do you have a, li uh, a link to it? Thiefcraft Skyrim. Okay, Thiefcraft. All right, I will look up Thiefcraft. Okay, great, get the link. So other than that link, I think I'm pretty much done for tonight. Whew. That was a good run. Pretty tough to manage it. I wouldn't have been able to do it on my own. It sounds cheesy, but I needed the support. <laughs> so... I'm going... Is my smooth lighting off? Feels like smooth lighting's off. That's just stairs. Um, okay. So I'm going to head off to bed now. I should be back around the same time tomorrow. 10pm my time. Feels like, a, feels like a good time because it's sort of not too late. and It, it gives me a good few hours before I really need to go to bed. And it's not too early for the Americans, I don't think. Well, you seem to be able to make it all right, Pepperoni. Let me have a look at something.
Whoa, I got five new followers tonight. Computers acting up. Okay, look up Thiefcraft. Thiefcraft. Thief. Thiefcraft custom map. I will do that. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much for coming, everyone who came, even though you're not here anymore. And uh, thanks for sticking around, Pepperoni. And hopefully I'll see you tomorrow and then on Saturday for my marathon for charity. I do you want actually no no my dog. I'll do all that on Saturday. Alright, thanks for coming and see you tomorrow, hopefully. Where's Nah, explode. Come back. Must stop broadcasting. See ya.